Welcome to Morningstar. With inflation still soaring and central banks all over the world trying to play catch up, there is an increasing worry about a looming recession and households are gearing up for a tough winter financially. What effects this might have on the retail sector is what we're going to dive into today with Morningstar's senior equity analyst, Yelena Sokolova. Yelena, entering a new economic climate where people have less money left over to spend in combination with increasing operational costs for companies, how well prepared do you think that the retail sector is for this new reality? Uh, thanks for having me, Johanna. Uh, indeed, it is a challenging environment currently for retail. Uh, so far, luxury names have really been faring uh, better uh, with their good track record of uh, pricing power uh, well above CPI and also exposure to consumer, uh, which is a bit more resilient to inflationary pressures. Of course, ma mass market apparel players are uh, more in a more challenging position with historically uh, have not been able to price above CPI. CPI and also exposed to consumers that are more economically sensitive. Then finally, online players are uh, really also facing an uphill battle with very challenging comparison base from prior years uh, affected by COVID lockdowns and uh, also escalating uh, transportation costs as well as weakening consumer sentiment. Okay, you mentioned pricing power and during times of uncertainty and high inflation, eyes are often turned to pricing power. So would you say that fast fashion brands like H&M, Primark and Zara stand a chance? For example, we've seen several downgrades for H&M following their latest sales figures. Indeed, uh, H&M sales figures have been weak and they come on uh, top of um, outlook downgrades by online players such as Zalando and ASOS, for instance. Uh, so far, the positive outlier here was really Inditex's Zara uh, that uh, so far has uh, seen its price um, actions accepted well by consumers as uh, sales were continuing to increase at a double-digit pace uh, in the recent quarters, even um, from a comparison basis last year, which was already above pre-COVID levels. Uh, so strong showing here, that is despite mid-single digit price increases and also discontinuation of uh, operations in Russia, which are the uh, one, ones of the biggest in the sector. So really strong here. Okay, so are there, are there any other retailers that you think are really standing out right now that might navigate the coming winter pretty well? I would really think that uh, Inditex is Zara. It's also our top pick, um, actually, from, from a company standpoint, from a business model quality standpoint. It's one of the few names which are actually narrow mode rated, according to Morningstar methodology. Uh, execution has been historically strong, and also from valuation standpoint, the shares look attractive. I think it is uh, very well positioned to take market share in current uh, difficult environment in a very uh, fragmented industry as they have a lot of cash to reinvest counter-cyclically and also still generate plenty of cash to increase shareholder rewards. Okay, so despite the, the challenging environment, there might be some retailers that are positioned well for these upcoming few months. Thank you, Elena, for sharing your thoughts. And until next time, I've been Joanna England for Morningstar. 